Well, I needed some help to predict this series after the Ducks won the last two games. And I came to the prettiest psychic I know, Angela, the Meadowland psychic. I'm going to get you to look at a player from each team and tell me how they're going to play. I need to know about this gentleman right here. His name is Paul Correa. Well, it seems for Paul he's going to give us a little bit more than we expect. And I think he's going to be a very strong and positive player into this game. Super! That's awesome. Okay, there's one for Paul. One other player, Joe Neuendijk. Well, it seems with Joe, I definitely do see that he's not going to be as positive. This puck here is the puck that hit Marty Baudur. Now, Marty has lost the last two games. He's the devil's goalie. He might bring the game. So he's, he's going to have a good game. He's going to have a very good game. Excellent. Patrick Elias, what do you feel on that? Patrick's going to be very pleased. This is the puck that hit J.S. Jaguar in game four. How do you feel that he's going to do in game five? Unfortunately, not as positive. Oh, Ducks fans aren't going to like to hear that. The Ducks fans might be a little bit disappointed. I'm sort of a psychic myself. I picked the Devils in six. Now, what do you think in this series? Well, I think the Devils fans is going to be more than pleased. I just want a quick private reading, selfishly for myself, okay? Am I going to coach again, or am I going to be stuck with John Saunders for the rest of my life? Let me see what the cards have please, to say. Please. Help me out, will you? I'm sorry, Barry, but the cards are showing that you will be stuck. <laughs> <laughs> My friend, Barry Melrose, we've been together know? together for 10 years. He's trying to get rid of us. All right, over on ABC, Game 5 is coming up. The winner will have a chance in Game 6 to wrap up the Stanley Cup. It's coming up. Jump over. We'll see you there in just a few minutes.